A frightening ordeal for hundreds of children in Sydney's west today when fire swept through part of their school. Several students at Chester Hill North Public School were treated for shock and smoke inhalation and one building was destroyed. Adrian Rochella has this report. <laughs> it was clearly a traumatic event for these young students who were forced to flee their school when a fire broke out just after midday. We're oh, scared. We're scared. Yeah. We were crying. We thought we were going to get burnt and smoke. Like and... We were doing our work in class, then we hear everyone yelling, then we look through the window, all smoke and everything. So we got really frightened and then we, like, almost the whole school started yeah. crying and it was like one yeah, of the scariest really days of my life. Paramedics treated 24 patients for smoke inhalation and shock. In all, 460 students were evacuated from Chester Hill North Public School to a nearby park when a blaze took hold in the administration building. Lots of people were crying and they had asthma attacks and all that. Um, they were coughing a lot and blood coming out of their mouth. Three adults and 16 children were taken to hospital, but paramedics say none of the injuries was serious. Frantic parents rushed to the school after hearing the news. Oh, I was shaking. Oh, I'm just shocked. I'm in the middle of the meeting. I just said, OK, I have to go, go to school. You know, that's some fear. How are you feeling now? Now I'm OK. he been safe, yeah. It took 30 firefighters about an hour to bring the blaze under control. In the end, the administration building was destroyed. A hundred children yet to be picked up were taken to Chester Hill High School to wait for their parents. Investigators say they don't yet know what caused the fire, but they do believe it was an accident. And because it didn't affect the rest of the school, classes will resume tomorrow. Adrian Rochella, ABC News, Sydney.